day two, yard work, starting off five exercises of legs. First exercise, we have deadlift. What you want to do, have your feet shoulder width apart, chest up. All we're going to do is keep a straight back, reach for our toes, stand straight up. You can do it with body weight or you can grab dumbbells. If you grab your dumbbells, just make sure you remain under control. Reach down all the way up. Don't arc your back. Keep your head up. Keeps your back straight. Next exercise, we have lunges. Chest up, pushing off the toe, coming back to start. Next, we have donkey kicks, all fours. Start with our right leg, and all we're doing, kicking up. To add more resistance, if you have ankle weights, you can put them on, do them like that. Next one, we have sumo squats. We're gonna get our feet wider than shoulder width. Toes pointed at 45 degrees. Hands inside. And all we're doing, just dropping our butt. You can grab a dumbbell or a kettlebell to give yourself more resistance. Pass. Just make sure you keep your chest up and just drop straight down. Next, we go on to plank push-ups. Nope, nope. Jumping jacks will be the fifth leg exercise. Standard jumping jack. Then we go to our upper body portion. We have plank push-ups, two ways you can do them. Hands and toes, and all it is is, that's one. You can do them on your knees. Making sure our hands are under our chest. Don't extend out in front. That's going to turn into a shoulder workout, and that's not what we want to. That's not what we want to focus on. Next exercise, we have lat raises. So with the dumbbell, we're just going shoulder width to the side, raising up, control down. Again, you can use a gallon of water, both hands, a box, whatever you have that has a little bit of weight if you don't have access to dumbbells. Our next exercise, we have pull-ups. We're gonna use a towel for the pull-ups. All you're doing, we're gonna keep the towel tight and you're just pulling to your chest. Feet could be flat on the ground or up in the air, it doesn't matter. You extend all the way out, pull up. Next exercise, we have tricep kickbacks. Feet shoulder width apart, bent at 45 degrees. We're gonna start like we have our guns in our holster and we're just extending. Coming back to 90 degrees. Our last exercise, upper body, we have bent over flies. So we're in that same position, knees bent, 45 degree lean, arms out, and we're here. Next exercise, we're going into abs. Starting off with leg raises. 
all the way up, back down without touching the ground. From there we have hip dips. We're on our elbows. All we're doing is just dropping our hips to the grip. Next, we have bicycles. Hands are going to be behind our head. We're just going elbow to knee. Next exercise, we have side planks. We'll make sure our elbow, hips, and our knee are aligned. Arm is going to be up. We're going to do one minute each side. So everything's in a straight line. Elbows under my shoulder. The only thing that's on the ground are my knees and my elbow. All right, our last, we have our standard sit up. Chin up. We go on to our yardio portion. We have step ups. If you don't have access to a bench or a curb, all you're gonna do, step. Make sure we drive that knee up. After that, we have a sprint and jog. So we're gonna fast feet for 10 seconds. And then we go 20 second jog. Sprint 10 seconds, 20 second jog. All right, from there we got vertical jumps. Feet shoulder width apart, hands up. All we're doing, jumping straight up, high as we can. Next, we have punches. We're gonna start 10 jabs, 10 crossover jabs, 10 uppercuts. Want to make sure we keep our core tight. We're punching here. All right. Punching with our core. Now our last one, we have high knee run. That's yard workout number two. Remember everything is one minute length. Repeating each exercise three times, get to work.